What's going on guys, it's your boy Pogo here, back for Pokemon Scythe with Bubba's Tan. Hello. As far as I'm aware, this is episode 8, and um, last episode we beat the Grover City Gym, along with finishing off Route 6. Um, did you get the quest from the flower shop? Nah, I didn't bother. Uh, well, personally I think you should be, we got, the woman told me I'd get paid. Don't know what, if it's real money or whatever. Uh, did some training as well. That's my Pokedex. Everyone's 27 apart from Hedion, who is now 20... Wait, who is... Yeah, 28. Um, like a fool, I've just realised I never named Mareep. And this guy had a Ponyta, but I accidentally beat him up while I was training. There's a bug catching it. Ooh. I just found T. Maybe it's that and just named. Is it the daycare man anyway? Yeah. Is there anything in the daycare? Just the woman and a PC. I. Mm. No, I'm not going to give anyone to the to the daycare lady. I I'm just going to carry on down Route Seven then. I'm just going to quickly do this flower mission, and then I've also there's it down. I mean, it's on Route 7. That's, like, where we're going. Oh. Ah, uh, got some orange juice with me. I've got my, I've got my orange juice, you know. Always need a drink while recording. Throat gets dry. Oh, this man has a cool trainer, Thora, has a Monferno and a Primplop, and Flaffy's just ruining them. Is T what I was supposed to find for this mission? Or? We were supposed to find the Gracidia flower, which is the one that changes Shaman's form, but I get the feeling that T was the item. I'm going to go check now. But there's also, like, the chance it was... There will be the actual item. Oh, no, we did find it with the T. Oh. Yeah. Miracle Seed. That boosts grass-type moves. Yeah, I'm going to put that on my, um, my guy. Oogway. Yeah. And from there... I'm pretty sure I'm just going to carry... I should have healed. Flaffy's, like, very low. Flaffy's dead. But Static paralysed this Machop, so, uh, yeah. Machop deserves it, really. Let's see, I've got Frog out now. Bubble Beam. Very nice. Dad Machop. Um, Primeape. I'll throw in Balloon. Balloon's a pretty useful mon, you know. Right, Shadow Ball. Ah, cool trainer Thora, I assume you're fighting now. Yes. This primate is just being rude. It's just screeching at me, what an angry monkey. Damn. A blitz will just absolutely, oh, I'm going to say absolutely annihilated this Monferno, but the Monferno just mugged me off royally. <laughs> I'm off to heal Flaffy and then I beat the first three trainers. I'm assuming there's going to be a few more. I don't remember which trainer it was. I think it was the one you're fighting or have just beaten. That said they were training for the for the next gym. Can't even remember what they said it was called, but you know. It's nice to know there are more gyms. Kind of expected it, but still. The one PC. Yeah, there'll be at least eight gyms, surely. I mean it's what I was expecting, but you never know. Unpredictable. Flaffy, just beat this up. I don't want to fight an Ariados. I'm so glad it's not, like, buff leech life. Oh, yeah. Buff leech life would be so AIDS to put up with. This man thought I was a bug and tried assaulting me. <laughs> oh, we're on the other side of Route 5. The, uh, the miners that were blocking us was, are still there, and they say there are some, um, 
some constructions on Route 7. One... Let's go. Oh, hmm, let's see. Yeah, here it is. Do you know One Piece City is found on the east far... Is oh, Words are not happening right now. It's found on the far east end of the Colon region. Technically, this place is the closest to Hoenn. Well, I c I've found some Team Void, so I'm going to see what this w tiny child has to say. Will you play with me? And now she's attacked me. Do you want to die? I'm not afraid to murder a child. Um... These... Well, not even these Pokemon, because they're not particularly that strong. It's just, they're assaulting Blitz up. Like, just let me level it up. See... I would also be having your problem, except Flaffy died once and is now just ruining things. Are you at Team Void yet? Because it appears there's all four of the grunts. Uh, no. Well, I shall wait here for you then. Alright. You look. Ah, yeah, very nice. Is that to Whirlipede or Scolipede? This is to Scolipede. My team are getting bare strong now. I do need a couple more evolutions before I can properly get, you know, really strong. When it all comes together though, easy dubs. You know, these grunts better not assault me because I'm just not in the mood for it, you know? Like, I can and will destroy them. Yeah, there's all four of them, so I doubt we'll get attacked by all four unless, like, Darlo shows up again. I honestly do believe he's more annoying than these grunts. Darlo? Darlo. I don't have out against Darlo particularly. I just, I dislike him. I don't know why. He's just a pest. Right, I'm actually going to have to switch train here. Like, uh, wow, excuse me. Can you just turn up at the grunts? Man, I'm trying to, but Marty just needs to get good. You can evolve Marty later, just lead with someone else. Tragic though, I've finished my orange juice. Need to beat up this child, pre-school adjusting. Just a flower. <laughs> uh, the absolute audacity. They went, will you play with me? And just tried attacking. Like, there's no need. Uh, these... Fairy. These grunts, they just... They better not assault. It's just going to be rude. It should be grass type. It should. Like, it should be grass fairy. I don't understand why it's not. It looks like a grass type. It's literally a flower. Oh. <sighs> don't tell me. Marty's dead. Now, Marty isn't dead, but the flower just used to wish. <laughs> Are you not in a position to kill it? When it wished on me, it was one hit. Everyone remembers our mission, right? We got to take over the ship dock before the other groups arrive. Let's go. We don't want to make the boss angry, are we? Seriously, that was... Oh. Pogo. This is bad. Very bad. While I was patrolling from the sky, I saw a huge ship heading towards One PC. I asked around, the sh this ship isn't authorised, so it's very likely that it's Team Void. What? You saw grunts marching in to take over the dock. I can't believe this. What are they planning? A takeover? Pogo. I know I'm not supposed to ask something like this from a kid. Whoa, chill out. But I need your help. That took a different turn than I was expecting it. We need to drive Team Void out of the city before it is too late. You got that? Good. There's no time to waste. Let's go. I'm looking for the Pokemon Center. Oh, you've got to be kidding. Say. They're blocking the Pokemon Center. That's just rude. There's a Phantom Preschooler who is here. I've but... got dialogue from someone with question marks. Uh, where did you go? 
I went to the beach. I shall also head to the beach. It says the city of war. Okay. Um, do you want to take them? Oh, uh, yeah. Who the hell do you think you are? Oh, this sounds this exactly. Sounds exactly like that. Oh, well, he came from the door. I'll have him then when we find him. Uh huh. Cut the crap out and talk. I'm starting to get tired of Team Void and its actions. Ka-chow! Lightning McQueen is back on the scene. You sound very violent. Do you battle like that too? Pogo? Ah, thank God. You arrived just in time. Oh, don't worry, I'm fine. But that creep is very strong. What? So he's the boss of Team Void. He's not a small deal, that's for sure. Finally, you're here. What took you so long? Why is it like all of my characters here? This is tragic, really. And at last, we have our hero to the rescue, huh? It's nice seeing you again, Pogo. As you can see, your friend didn't put up such a great fight. He's like a dog who barks, but doesn't bite when he needs to. Anyway, it looks like you didn't accept my advice and you kept chasing us. You got balls, kid. I give you that. You really think that we are the bad guys here, don't you? Yeah, everyone thinks that. You're no different, then. Though I saw the potential in you to understand. We're just trying to make a better world, where people will help each other no matter what. There won't be any more betrayal. No more... reneging? I don't know. I hope you understand everything now, and won't get in our way anymore. Beep. Every unit that hears me, we are done here. We've gotten everything we needed. Everyone gather on the ship as we are... Everyone gather on the ship. We are leaving. Beep. To understand that my actions aren't exactly evil as you think. I won't do anything to you, not to your friend. If you're mature and smart enough, you will understand. If you don't, well then I guess we will see each other again, very soon. Take care, Pogo. I have my faith in you. Jeez, man, these are actual fat dialogues. This guy gives me chills. The way he speaks, it's so calm, yet dangerous. I mean, he is Lightning McQueen. I'm flying after them and see where they go with their ship. Maybe they will lead me to their base. Take care. That creep is scary. You really are brave if he warned you and you really didn't listen. I don't understand why they are they doing all of this. If what they really want is what he said. I seriously don't understand people sometimes. Anyway, I'll head to the gym now. We are still not done, you know. Well, I hope that means we can heal. Um, we can. Hmm? Team Void are actually the good guys. I'm gonna cry. There's some Go to the Pokemon Center. Yeah, I'm there. The Pokemon Center has been taken over. As long as we are here, you won't move even an inch from where you stand. What the? Didn't Kitchow say they are leaving? Huh? What is this kid doing here? Didn't a grunt from Unit A guard the entrance? Speaking of Unit A, it is very quiet outside. What happened? Did the units leave the area? Thanks, sir. Well, entering the building. If you hadn't, they probably wouldn't have, have had notice that they're gone. Here, take this as my gratitude. HMO 2. Uh, can't say I actually remember what that... Oh, fly, I think. So we can fly back to other areas if we need. What's the special shop here? Repeat ball, time of ball, luxury ball. Don't need any of you. I'm going to explore the city and then we'll find the gym, I guess. Fletchinda can now fly. We moved here recently with my husband. The city was taken over. Can you believe that? I can. I was here for them to do it. Yeah. Nothing upstairs. I'm really hoping for, like, something just useful, like an item. Uh, shut up about your son. Nobody really cares. Um, right. Top up here. Oh, I think I found the gym. Hmm? Ah, one pigeon. I'm pretty sure it's water type. This place is called the City of Water. Oh, it has to be. Oh, it's in boxing rings. It might be fighting type. Well, that's just wrong. No. Yeah, it's fine. So far, nobody's given me anything either. That's an empty house. Why? There's no need for that, really. Um. Scraggy just came in with some swag. Phantom Fisherman. That's where Kachow was. 
They stole all the vehicles, apparently. Are those rock smash rocks? Well, I don't even get a prompt, so I don't know. Um... Well, Scraggy's probably going to upset me muchly, but I'm just going to lead with Balloon. I just, I dislike this. There's really no need for it to be fighting when it's the city of water. Like, I've been deceived and I don't appreciate it. <clears throat> Oh no. Balloon nearly just got one hit by Scraggy. Rip. Now he's using Gerda. You know what, if Balloon dies, Balloon dies. I will literally just bring in, like, a different... Oh, yes, he missed. Okay. I crit hit Gerda and it lived on, like, two. And it missed its rock throw, so that's a level on Balloon. <gasps> yes! Balloon is evolving. First on-screen evolution. Driftblim is going to be throwing shadow balls left, right, and center. Um, I can't believe this is your first on-screen evolution. Everything else has just been doing it while I've been training. I'm going to bring uh, Staraptor out first. I'm oh, not Staraptor, Staravia. I am but a mere fool. Mm, what have you done this time? I forgot to switch Nando out because I was switch training my, so it's going to take me even longer. Now. <laughs> Rip. How many trainers have you beat? Uh, I'm on the third. Uh, I'm currently beating up the second. Uh, yes, yeah, second. Jonathan's putting in absolute work. Come on, paralyze him. Damn! How did you block such strong attacks? I mean, get an attack off and I'll tell you. Black Belt Bram with his Hall Ucha. You just... You're an absolute wench. Marty is evolving at last. Oh, this Hall Ucha just encored me like I wasn't going to wing attack again. Oh, that gave me a lot of XP. Let's go. Trying to learn Aerial Ace. Let's go. Um, I'm going to get rid of... I'm going to get rid of... Uh, I'm going to get rid of Tackle. Keep Quick Attack for those situations when I'm slower. That is generally what Quick Attack's for. Is there a trainer, like, double battle trainers here? I'm not sure. I, I've seen what you're talking about. They look like they're going to do it to me. Oh, I'd wonder. This Timber just, just threw a rock at me. Hit me. And did, like, not very much damage. I was expecting to die from it. Nah, Jonathan's actually putting in, like, work, though, like you would not believe. Oh, Marty is, like, instantly so much strong since he evolved. Oh, yeah. I would be using Drift Blim if it wasn't on, like, 9 health. Well, that's Jonathan at 29. I'm going to put Frog in front, and then I'll put mm, I'll put Flaffy in front as well. Not Flaffy. I said Flaffy while literally making a decision to not use Flaffy. It's not a double battle. They both just stand there. Oh, you've made a mistake leading with Monferno. I'm still perfectly fine. I've just got, like, my Pokemon are tanky enough to just take hits. Dish oh, out. I, I could definitely beat them with the Pokemon I've got bought, but. Because I'm going to go heal before the gym leader. I don't just really want to have to, like, run and heal twice. Oh, I thought they were the gym leader. No, these are just random trainers. Uh, Frog is 28. Muddy Water, uh, that is... I would get rid of Bubble Beam, but this is better than Supersonic. Supersonic is not a very good move. And, yeah, now you attack me, and I'm pretty sure the gym leader's next. 
Bloom. Great, I am not staying in there. Let's go Hedion. Trying to counter me. What a buffoon. Absolutely not letting that happen. He's going to hit me with it again, isn't he? Yep, ouch. Ah, oh, I really should have expected that, but for some reason I didn't. Yo, wait, what? Madness. Um, On the evolution, I went... Driftblum went from having, like, 9 health to 42. This is incredible. And also, he's about to get his first, like, action since he evolved. Poor Bopple's just being, like, left behind. He's just not having, like, good gym tie things. Did Bopple ever evolve, or is he still a... Still a tiny uh, Aaron. Aaron? He's just not got that power yet. I mean, he's really, like, he is really strong, he's just... I'm not bringing him in a Steel Rock type against a fighting gym. You know, to me, that just seems like I'd want him to die, and I wish to keep him alive. Ah, thank you, Nurse Joy. I need my Pokemon healed fully. Um, who shall I lead with? I'll lead with Baloo and see what happens with that. So are you at the gym leader, or those two trainers? I'm literally just about to buy this last one. I am currently at the gym leader. Yo, he looks like One Punch Man. One punch. Oh, you've got to be kidding. It's literally One Punch Man's name backwards for his... Oh, I knew he looked like One Punch Man. You, you can't tell me you've not seen it. It's incredible. Welcome to my gym. You probably didn't know, but we use this gym as a dojo too. Well, really, couldn't tell. I'm the master of this dojo and the so-called gym leader. However, I'm a gym leader just for fun, but nowadays it got kind of boring. There were only a handful of trainers who could defeat me, and most of those were just lucky. Anyway, let's get through this. The badge is why you're here, after all. It's literally just ripped off some of the lines from One Punch Man. Right. Punch man. Don't you mean Francis Ngannou? <sighs> I'm sure more than like one of his fights have taken multiple punches though. Well, yeah, obviously they have, but... <laughs> exactly. I'm sure that one punch man's fights have taken more than one punch at some point. I mean, I've only seen season one because I'm cheap and I'm not like trying to find somewhere to watch season two. But there's only been one fight that's taken more than one. And literally at the end of the fight, the guy says, you weren't going all out. So clearly, it could have just been all one. You know, that's the whole gimmick. If it, if it took more than one punch, it wouldn't be a very good show. I feel like Shadow Ball will be doing more than Gust. It's surprisingly good. You wouldn't expect it to be, but you know. Balloon is actually on. Balloon is on an absolute mad one here. Surprise. I mean, neither am I really, but still, like, this is more of a mad one than I expected. Well, that's the entire gym rolled with Balloon. Let's go. John Mai doesn't, still doesn't really do anything. This battle was quite good. I really enjoyed it. That's something I haven't said for a while. Well, take this. You really deserve it in my book. Training badge. Also, accept this. TM01. Focus punch? Yep, that's garbage. What an idiot. Why would I ever think that um, Uguay would outspeed Hitmonchan? <laughs> I wish to not have Focus Punch as a TM. He could have given, like, Brick Break or some other good fighting move. Oh, well, Wattles is outside the gym, so I'll wait for you to get here for you. So you can dialogue him. Nice. Oh, leave me alone, old man. 
Leave the bald man alone. Just don't do not be rude. He's not leaving me alone. Just grow some hair, you know. Ugh. I cannot believe we've literally just beaten a One Punch Man. Like, that was not something I was expecting ever, really, yeah. in a Pokemon game. I heard from Laurie what happened here. You're really heroic for standing against Team Void. Maybe too heroic. Anyway, you walked out the gym, so does that mean... You really got the badge. My, my. So the truth, I'm really proud of you. I remember the time when I asked... That favour, and you came back frightened by Laurie's septile. You've already changed uh, so much. Being this far in the league challenge, standing up for people against that guy, I really feel like you can accomplish anything. But I need, you to, I need to ask you one thing from you, and please take it very seriously. Stop this affair with Team Void. I know you had everything under control, but what if something happens to you? I'd be responsible for it. I seriously need you to understand that this is mo much more than you think. As we know, this isn't just a simple gang of outcasts. It's a serious organisation with the money, power, influence and team to accomplish what they want. Anyway, I'll let you get going. I just wanted to tell you this. I almost forgot. You probably don't know where the 7th gym is. It's in Freve City, in known territory for you. So finding it probably won't be hard. Oh, you'll definitely need this to access it. Ah, so? I'm sure you got what it takes to become the region's first champion. I assume we just got Surf. I'm pretty sure that, that three is Surf. Uh, TM case? It is Surf indeed. Right, let's see. Frog can learn it. Let's go. Gyarados can learn it for me. Get rid of Bubble Beam. While Bubble Beam is a good move, I also have Muddy Water, so uh, garbage. Wow. I'm actually very glad that I got Surf, because Giratras needs a water move. Right, let's... I think the move now is to not get tricked by that ledge again, as I have been done like three times now. Heal up and end the episode there. Today we have beaten Team Void once again, and by beaten we kind of just scared them a little bit. Um, Beaten One Punch Man. And got our sixth gym badge. And obtained Surf, along with way too much dialogue. Uh, anything you want to add? Uh, eat. Understandable. Have a nice day. Adios.